Hey guys, this is a quick video for installing fresh Windows 10 on your PC. First thing is we need to make a Windows 10 bootable USB drive. For that we need a working PC, an 8GB USB, Windows 10 ISO file which you can download from Microsoft website and a small software called Rufus. I'll provide all the download links in the description below. So after downloading all the necessary files we can start with the process. So this is uh, Windows 10 1909 version which is the latest. So now I'm gonna plug in my USB. Um, I'm using a 8GB USB. So now open Rufus. So here's my USB. Now select the Windows 10 ISO which you have downloaded. Open and select partition scheme to GPT. So click on start, click on ok. So this is gonna take a while like 10 to 15 minutes based on your system. So after a few minutes, your Windows 10 USB installation drive is ready. So just remove it and plug it in to your system and start with the installation process. Now plug in the USB drive in the system in which you want to install Windows 10. After plugging in, power on the PC. After powering on, press the delete key a few times which takes you to your BIOS. Here you can see the USB drive on the right side under your SSD. You can also access boot menu by pressing F8 a few times when you power on your PC. Now open the boot menu and select the boot source to your USB drive. Now choose your language and click next install now now here if you have a product key enter it or else click on i don't have a product key here select the windows version which you want to install i'll be installing windows 10 pro into my system accept the agreement and click on next choose the custom installation option here i have installed a 120 gb ssd into my system I'll be deleting all the unwanted older Windows 10 partitions. Now you won't see all these many partitions in a uh, new SSD. It will be a single one. Select the drive in which you want to install Windows 10 in case you are having two or more drive installed in your PC. Here it takes time. If you are installing Windows 10 on your SSD, the process is really fast. After everything is completed, it automatically restarts. It's restarting once again. Now you are almost done. Now you'll see just a few basic settings which you can complete by yourself. Now we have successfully installed Windows 10 on our PC guys. So after this we need to activate Windows 10 
you can use a product key or else I have made an another video where you can activate Windows 10 for free it's a small video I'll suggest you on the top and I'll even provide the link in the description make sure you check it out so that's it for this video guys thanks for watching